Hello, friends. Hello, how's it going? Uh, welcome to Brandbeard Gaming. I am Richmond, one half of uh, Brandbeard Gaming. Uh, Phantom Meebel, Ancient Moor, and Luna. Hello, how are you all doing today? Uh, what's going on? Uh, how is everybody doing on this Friday afternoon? Uh, or some uh, whatever time it is in Europe at this time? But uh, welcome. Uh, if you are new here, I occasionally do... Um, uh, kind of nap time streams. I have a, I have a, I have a small two year old kiddo who, or three year old kiddo now, geez, uh, who takes naps about this time. And if I can make a stream work, I will. Uh, and we were, uh, very much, uh, lucky enough to be gifted a key, uh, from private division, uh, for Ollie Ollie world, uh, which is the new skateboarding game, uh, that has come out. It is its predecessors, Ollie Ollie and Ollie Ollie two, are uh, some of our favorites. So, uh, yeah, it is it is one central here. Uh, it has been snowing all day. I say snowing all day, but it's been spitting all day. It iced all night last night. Uh, but, yeah, just here hanging out. Hope everybody's doing well. Uh, I saw that Luna said, uh, Brambeard and Stumped are my two favorite channels to watch, so I get really excited when they go live. Well, A, uh, we appreciate you being here, and two, um, you know, just to be lumped in together with Stump is uh, awesome. Uh, they're, they're a much bigger channel than we are, uh, so we're glad that uh, you found us and that we uh, you enjoy what we do. We've been doing this for since August of 2020. Uh, we started out as predominantly a uh, board game and tabletop gaming channel. Uh, TJ and I uh, have known each other for upwards of like six or seven years now. And uh, during the pandemic, we just decided that we were going to um, start. Well, it was once Origins got canceled. We were like, hey, you know what? Let's just, we're going to start Brandbeard Gaming. Uh, and it was just a way for us to continue to play board games with each other through the, through the uh, pandemic. And it's just kind of uh, continued. And we do uh, some board gaming content and we do some um, co op video gaming content. A lot of chaos based co-op games uh, as i'm sure you've seen us play um played up over the last couple weeks which uh by and far have been our largest streams we've ever had um so we're just kind of lucky that um you know the algorithm lottery hit and we uh we were able to hang out with uh, a bunch of new people so thank you all for being here uh joe hope you're doing well uh dropped in to see uh, phantom meeple and uh panda angel yesterday as they were um playing uh, a game over on Pan Angel's channel. Uh, so, yeah. But, ho again, hope you all are doing well. We're currently getting rain, which sucks, uh, just that uh, big snowstorm, so it's rain on top. Ugh. As long as it doesn't freeze. As long as that doesn't freeze into ice or black ice, uh, should be uh, should be good. We got, uh, we got some uh, spitting ice last night uh, to where it made our sidewalks pretty slick, and then we got uh, a little bit of snow today. So, but I've got to go out and do some stuff this afternoon uh, after old nap time is over. A big kid. Thank you all for being here on a Friday. Um, yesterday, I played some uh, Ollie Ollie 2, or not Ollie Ollie 2, Ollie Ollie World, uh, again from Private Division. Thank you to them for the key uh, to be able to play this. It is a fantastic game, um, it is super customizable. It is, uh, yeah, it's fantastic. So, uh, as far as schedule, uh, for the upcoming week, we're probably going to stick to what we've been doing for the last couple weeks, uh, which is, um, uh, Gloomhaven on Tuesday, played up on Wednesday. Ooh. Oh, and then a week from tomorrow. So Saturday, the 19th, uh, we will be part of Givers and Gamers. Alone Shark, hello. Hope you're doing well. Good to see you. Um... We're going to be part of Givers and Gamers. Uh, it is a uh, charity fundraiser for uh, the Ronald McDonald uh, House Charities of the Bluegrass, which is located in Lexington, Lexington Kentucky, uh, raising money for um, sick kids uh, who need a little help and their families as well. Um, so there's a link there. If you feel so inclined uh, to donate, great. If you're not able to, don't want to, no worries, no sweat off. Uh, yeah, no sweat off. I don't know. I don't know what the phrase is, but it's fine. No worries. I'm um, just putting that there if anybody is inclined to donate, and we'll be raising money for the next uh, week or so. We'll probably put that out on uh, Twitter and Facebook. Uh, and then lastly, we'll hit uh, 
if you are not following us on Twitter, follow us on Twitter. That's where we usually put our schedule stuff up. Uh, and also uh, the YouTube channel. We just put up uh, the first two runs of uh, Wednesday's Played Up stream today over on YouTube. And uh, on Monday, we will put up uh, the uh, second run. So go check that out. Go follow us over there if you haven't done so yet. Uh, yeah, we'd appreciate it. Uh, all the follows help. It's fantastic to uh, just see all the people who are checking out and enjoying the played up streams over there. Uh, and we'll try and do some more community content over there as well. Uh, Panic, hello, hello, how are you, friend? Good to see you. Uh, hope you are doing well. Hope you're uh, still enjoying um, Uncharted 3. Didn't the Uncharted, Uncharted movie come out today? Is that this weekend? I still think the Tom Holland choice is interesting, to say the least. But um, I'm glad that he. I'm glad that the movie got made. I think uh, Sully with no mustache is a little weird, uh, but it is, it is what it is. We'll. I'll probably see it at some point, just because I love Uncharted very much. Uh, but yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and get uh, moving on into Ollie Ollie World. Uh, I had a fantastic time with it yesterday. The, um, the, uh, the music is a vibe and I love it. And I'm going to be dancing this entire time. Uh, so just get into it. Get, uh, Uncharted 3 is done. Moved on to Heavy Rain. Ooh. I'll have to check that out. Yeah, Uncharted 3 is fantastic. Uh, the long walk through the desert is a trip in many ways. Uh, but let me go ahead and switch over to the gameplay. Let me know if the audio is too loud. But, I mean, this is it's a jam. Well, I mean, yeah, I, I agree. Tom does seem a little small for the role, but like, even just in his voice, the, like, Nathan Drake had some gravitas and some, some gravelly and graveliness to his voice. Uh, especially like when he would yell about stuff. Um, so, you know, it is what it is. I'll probably see it. I can't say that I won't see it. Um, but yeah, we appreciate it. Uh, I said, I'm looking at two different things. Um, thank you for the donation. Um, I just got an email, but I haven't gotten to check it out yet. But thank you for the donation uh, for whoever did that. We appreciate it. We're looking forward to Gears and Gamers. It's going to be awesome. Um, yeah. We're going to be playing golf with your friends on... Uh, we're going to be playing golf with your friends on Saturday with some other streamers as well. So um, please know that if I don't win, I'll at least know that I took out TJ. Uh, Deadpan, hello. Dutch Yoda, hello. It's good to see you all here. It's good to, it's good to uh, have a good day on a Friday. All right, so we're going to get into Ali Ali World. Uh, yesterday, uh, basically, the uh, basically the vibe of this game is that there are five skate guys that we're trying to impress because the the person who is uh, kind of the conduit between the skate gods is retiring, I guess, and so now they're looking for that new person between the skate gods, and so uh, I think I have to prove myself in some way, some form or fashion. Uh, to be able to do that so let me uh, let me go back to let me see if I can do this one let's, let's see if I can get back in the action um, but yeah this game is fantastic loving it already um, uh, I probably won't do all of the story but we'll see we'll see what happens um, so I need to, uh, let's see, I need to boop three ghost tall frogs, uh, do three different advanced tricks in a single combo, uh, and, I, and I found and catch the zombie before the finish. So the way this game works is uh, your, your, nope, your left stick uh, does all the tricks. So if you hold down and let go, it does an ollie. If you do like half circles and quarter circles and you know three quarter circles, you'll do different tricks. Um, and then you just uh, push with your uh, with the B button, and it just propels you along. So 
Uh, and then when you get to a rail, you just hold a direction on the stick and it will automatically lock you to the rail. And so you're just trying to rack up some combos. Um, but it's fun. I'm pretty addicted to it. Uh, and it's easy to, you can wall ride by doing the same thing. You just hold onto the stick. You always want to make sure you build up enough speed because you are always finding a new... Oh. So I just learned that if you hold the right stick, uh, you can do grabs. And we just miss it. Slivers, hello. Build up that speed, noobs. Uh, Sliver's got a nice little uh, comment on our YouTube page about uh, how people like his comments, so we're going to try and not let that go to Sliver's head. Sliver said that that's not... I think I racked myself on that rail. Uh, well, anything with a controller is hard for me. Not that kind of gamer girl. I... Um, I don't play a lot of, like, in-depth games often, and so that's why I play games like this, because it just... Yeah, I got that ghost bee. Um, I don't know. It's just not... Um, it's not too bad. Like, I don't mind it. And you... I got used to the controls pretty well. Alright, so let's uh, pick up the story where I was last on. I tried to not play uh, anything story-based while I was offline. Uh, but there is a spot in uh, the area called Narvana. Um, where if you go here, you can either do like proce procedurally generated levels that have codes to them so that you can send this procedurally uh, generated level to your friends and then you can compare your times. And then this one is a league uh, where once a day they'll have a track that you can uh, race and then based on your score, uh, you will get something. You might unlock a piece of clothing or a board or something like that. So, uh, Thank you all for being here on Friday. Uh, so we're down here. Uh, we have to complete two of two out of three of these um, missions around uh, this large tree called Thick Mary. Uh, so here we go. And you'll see like all these combinations of skaters on these screens and I don't know if they're like if they belong to actual users or not yeah my sons get frustrated that I won't play their games but give me a mouse and a keyboard my mind can't grasp it um yeah the I don't, I don't know if I mean this is on Steam so I don't know if you could actually play you probably could actually play it on um with mouse and keyboard or at least um the rest of the keyboard uh oh yeah Joe I forgot that Mark set the Lurk uh, announcement yesterday. Uh, but yeah, so that's the new Lurk announcement for uh, Brambert Gaming. Uh, Agent Moore says, perhaps. Uh, welcome to the top of... Oh yeah, I forgot to turn off those Lurks as well. Oh well. Uh, actually, let me fix that. Just because I don't want to... Uh, I don't affect anybody's privacy. Uh... notifications uh, I just want to make sure that I don't um, I don't basically like you know it's like a real um, can you tell I like skateboarding games by the way I should fresh 14 hour smoke pulled pork and pulled chicken for lunch I'm nom 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 that sounds delicious um yeah, can you tell I like skateboarding games? All right, here we go. Welcome to the top of Thick Mary. Best views in Cloverbrook. This is what I thought when you said we'd get high, Suze. Hey, where's Dad? There's a character named Dad. Uh, I think he's gone to the twi uh, the Twiggy's factory to restock for bits. Ooh, I want some wheels. Twiggy's wheels are the rolliest. Today we gotta escape this super dangerous spot while dad isn't around. There's no time for shopping. On a non-game 
related note, when you guys both play, can you point me to a good tutorial on how to stream with two webcams? Uh, sure. Yeah, absolutely. It's um, like how we do it, um, because uh, I basically just uh, connect to TJ through Discord, and then TJ streams from his computer. Um, but yeah, I can I can definitely um, get that information to you. That's not a problem. Just uh, whisper me on Discord, and I'll uh, that'll help me remember to uh, get that information to you. All right, I need to ride the massive wall ride for the crowd and finish. Boop the frog off the explorer bee and boop all the frogs riding bees. Here we go. Enough speed. Now we're starting to get into harder, uh, harder levels. to do a thing there. I forget what it is. Is it... There's a way. It's called Firecracker. And it's uh, a thing you have to do so that you can, like, ride down the stairs. missed something, I think. I, well, I missed that jump is what I did. Why am I not... I'm not, uh, I'm not getting that jump today. There we go. Alright. All this is just me, like choosing a direction on the left or right stick, or like the left or right stick. What a rush! That was insane. I've never felt so much serotonin in my brain at once. Nice is a lot less anxiety than the lonely mountains. True that, Bumpy Biscuits. True that. Oh yeah, there is a Discord. Uh, Alert there. I've never felt so much serotonin in my brain at once. I got some awesome footage of you then. The others are refilling their pockets with Twiggy's merch. I don't judge. I mean, there's no ethical consumption under late capitalism, so I'm trying to buy as little as possible at the moment, but, uh... At least Twiggy's products are sustainably sourced. Let's go find them. I completed the level. Uh, I did not do any of the other challenges, which would have gotten me a pro board. Uh, but I did do the, so the local heroes at the bottom, if you beat all of their scores, then you also get, like, a piece of kit. This one was me getting a tattoo. Uh, but if I completed all of Mike's challenges, I would have gotten a new board. So, like, every level, like, every level that you're on, there's a chance to unlock at least two, like, pieces of customizable gear, um, for your character. Which is awesome. I think it's cool to, they make it a point to make sure that, like, you're, um that you are uh, expressing yourself as a person. So there's all kinds of like different, you know, combinations of things to wear and hats and uh, head covers and like all kinds of stuff. It's very cool. 
Here's another thick Mary fact you're gonna enjoy. Give me the lowdown. It's strictly forbidden to skate on thick Mary's face. But once I snuck in at night and grinded her nose, rules like that are there to make things fun and safe. Isn't that right, Chiffon? Jefferson only met Flora because she pushed the boundaries. Yeah, smash the rules. All right, so score 30,000 points in a single combo. Uh, wall ride the three log folk billboards. Do two different special tricks and one basic trick in a single combo. I probably can do that. Uh, and then beat the local heroes. What's everybody getting up to this weekend? What's uh, what's on what's on the docket for everybody? Woobsy, uh, it's fantastic. Uh, I'm loving it. Uh, I could be better, but it is all about. I'm really only giving each run like one, uh, like one attempt, so it's not like. I've had a chance to like figure out all the oh there are a ton of levels um, I'll show you once I get out of this one I'll show you the I'll show you kind of the map and that way you can go down that other route. So if you hit Y on your, or at least, at least on the Nintendo controller, you can um, go to different routes. So if you see a sign that like gives you a, uh oh, whoa, bye, uh, that gives you an option, you can kind of go back and forth. I, I uh, wall rid three wall folk billboards. So that's exciting. Uh, let's see. Bumpy Biscuits, does anyone else plan on reluctantly watching the Super Bowl? Attending a birthday on Saturday, DMA Dungeon and Dragons for family and friends on Sunday. Uh, Woobsy is debating this Kingdom Hearts Cloud Edition. Uh, if you ask TJ, TJ is not happy about it, uh, mainly because it's just the, it, because it's cloud-based. I think he would like to be able to own the own the game and not have to play it on uh, cloud because I mean, that's one of TJ's favorite um, franchises is Kingdom Hearts. Uh, Contemporary Dice, hello, welcome. Uh, Contemporary Dice is. Uh, also a part of Givers and Gamers 2.2 uh, happening next weekend. Uh, so we will be hanging out with them for Golf with the Friends on Saturday. Uh, I will be watching the Super Bowl. Uh, it'll be interesting to see uh, Cincinnati. Uh, I'm a former Cincinnati native. Uh, so I'll be excited to see Cincinnati in the Super Bowl. Uh, but glad to not have to be there if they lose. Adam, hello. Good to see you, friend. Uh, yeah. I think a lot of people are upset about the cloud-based Kingdom Hearts, I think. Like, I, I don't know. It's hard to tell. Um, hope the Bengals can finally pull off not playing the Nine ourselves. Yeah, that's true. Uh, Huday also to you, a Lone Shark. Uh, yeah, TJ's not super happy about the... Um, is not super happy about the cloud system, I think. Again, everyone wants to own it. Um, I'm just getting through the dialogue on this. Uh, dialogue's all great, by the way. Um, but none of it is actually like super necessary to the gameplay. Uh, and uh, I've heard there are a lot of glitches and very laggy. I mean, yeah, that's that's the other thing. Like, if you're, it all just kind of depends on the system, right? So it's not like the you know the cloud that you're trying to play on, or you know, there's a lot of factors that are out of your control when you're playing on a cloud-based system or when you're playing cloud-based instead of on your actual um, physical console. Uh, all right, so Woobsy was here. Uh, so each level, or so there are five different zones. Um, so there's 19 story levels here, plus side quests, plus optionals. Um, here there's 13 levels, uh, two side quests, three. So it's like 14, 11, 12. And then this Narvana area allows you to create procedurally generated areas. 
essentially, uh, that will let you, uh, it will give you a code for that area and then you're able to, sh you can share that code with your friends and then you can uh, skate it to try and, um, you can skate it and try and have the best score amongst your friends. But also uh, you can go to this league area and it'll put you in a league and then every day you can skate uh, one area and try and get the best combo or the best total score on that run. Um, so, I mean, I think it's, I'm super happy with it already. Um, I've still got three more zones to even unlock. So, uh, we're just kind of, you know, figuring it out. I've still got branch heights to do, but I'm gonna skip that. Uh, let me get back over to, uh, here. Let's see. Uh, this is $80 for the series too. I mean, I think there are a lot of people who'd pay 80 bucks for, um, Kingdom Hearts for like all of Kingdom Hearts on Switch, as long as it wasn't cloud-based. You know, got a piece of ice. Um, I mean, it's just it's hard to tell. I haven't played Kingdom Hearts in forever, but I know TJ was uh, not super pumped about the uh, cloud base issue. Yeah, 80 bucks is reasonable for all of Kingdom Hearts if you were able to keep it. This is my mate Woodstock. Woodstock looks rad, by the way. Nice to meet you, Woodstock. Hello, good sir. How are you? Do you want the polite answer or the honest answer? I feel you, Woodstock. I feel you. Told you Woodstock was a laugh, laugh a minute. I mean, even the hair, like the long hair under the headband? Killer. I suppose you want to skate my wood yard here. That's how Woodstock talks now. We do. Let's slam some deck and smash some wood chip. I spent years creating this island of calm away from the disturbance of humanity. Thanks. Oh, I mean, that's how his that's how his avatar voice sounds. I was trying to, to mimic it. Crash and burn, yo. Groovy, just groovy. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just just trying trying to entertain. Uh, all right. Twiggy's uh, variegated dress and the Woodstock. Pro board. So as long as I get over fifty-two thousand, I can have the Woodstock Pro board, which looks pretty cool. Looks like an actual like piece of wood. Making me happy. That's what you're doing, Richmond. Feel you, buddy. I feel you. Uh, all right, let's do this. So I learned to manual yesterday, which uh, allows you to kind of keep the run going. Oh god, but not like that. Oh no, I forgot that B is. So I changed it up so that B isn't, uh, what up? So the way it was working is that uh, A, all over here, and Y were your two main buttons. But I wanted B and Y to be my button, so I switched them. But the problem with B is that now I'm trying to use it to accept when all it does is back me out of menus. Pro streamer. Uh, but yeah. What up, no soul? How are you, buddy? Sorry, Woodstock. Oh, you missed a great voice for Woodstock, by the way. Uh, no soul. I mean, it was A plus voice work. We're not having A plus. Oh, no. Oh, I did it again. I did it. I did it again. God, look at all these cool looks, though. The Reaper 31. Got a cool look. All right. You can do this, Richard. I believe in you. It's a, it's a, it's a pre-skate pep talk right here. And again, this game is just a vibe. The music, all of it. Killer. I don't know why I keep doing the manual, because clearly it's not working. Gnarly root. You gotta be quicker on the, uh, you gotta be quicker on the, on the switch. No pun intended. Nope. That was rough. There we go. Not going fast enough for this gnarly route. 
The gnarly route's tough because, it, again, it, it's gnarly. It's the harder route. Nope. Oh, God. Uh, bumpy biscuits. I don't know. This may be this may be as rough as. Uh... Oh, I didn't mean to stop on that one. Lonely mountains downhill. I've lost it, kids. I've lost it. I'm no longer a pro skater. All right. Last time on the gnarly route. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Actually, that's totally believable. I see you frog on that bee. Come on, get enough speed. Oh, that was a strong run too. How far back did I go? Not too far. Just that one spot. Oh, I did see you playing skate, by the way. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not getting off that rail enough. Uh, I forget how much I enjoy the game. I saw that. Uh, I thought I saw an article yesterday where they were talking about they took down the Skate Two servers um, after the game was like regaining popularity, which sucks because like it's a solid game. Oh, Richmond needs more speed. What's happening? I mean, this is like a Lonely Mountains downhill stream right now. Uh oh. You are nope. hitting things. That is what is happening. Thank you, Sliver. Thank you for the bits. Oh, God, I don't know why I'm having a problem with that jump. All right, you got this, Christian. One, two, on. There we go. I don't know why. I, oh, good. I'm glad there wasn't anything left after that because I did, uh... I did a, uh... Manual out of it. Got some more awesome cami footage for you, then. You don't need to record things. Flora seems to sees every trick we do. That's why I moved here to get away from the ever watching BDI of Flora. Thank you. That's my that's my, my Woodstock voice. Um, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna replay that level as a whole. I think I think I can. I might have an emote to check out if it's... Oh, no. I love it. I love it. The best. No soul's the best. Emote extraordinary emote creator extraordinary. Oh yeah, I already looked. If I had a second, I'd already go ahead and upload it to the back end, but that's okay. That's alright. Again, thank you all for hanging out on a uh, on a Friday afternoon, evening, depending on wherever you are. I'm surprised your crew hasn't told you about the protecting your knees. My knees? I don't need advice. Oh dear, landings. I completely forgot about the most important skill. Safety first, safety second, and fun third. That's my motto. 
just before you hit the ground, press B. The closer you are to the ground, the better quality your landing will be. Safer. And more stylish. Give me them landing points. I actually knew that. Uh, I've been doing that this whole time. So, you'll get more points uh, based on your landing. Uh, they used to make it a thing where... Uh, they used to make it almost uh, the flash of emote extraordinaire. Oh, yeah. Well, this one, I think, has been in the works for a little while. Um, but, yeah, it goes, with, it goes with my entire vibe, which is... But, no. Nice landing. Thank you. Thank you for the land. Thank you for the nice landing. Uh, that is a tutorial. So, we only have a couple left. Things are happening all over the place. That could have been really bad. I actually hit the, the talk to the talk feature on the uh, on the nest cam. Uh, that would have been really bad if she wakes up. I'd be I'd be real upset. Just because somebody just because somebody sent me a picture. I don't know where that is, Adam, but uh, I've I've seen that before. The whole bin of wrestling figures. Log Folk Graveyard. Okay, good news. It didn't wake her up. We're all good. All good in the hood. You want to know more about this place before you smash it? Looks kind of creepy, huh? Nah, I, was already, I already had it up. I saw it. Uh, Yeah, what's up with that? This place is really spooky. Oh, I bet there are zombies here. Mike, it's graveyard. The sp it's Spook Central, full of spooky. There are zombies here for sure. Are you, are you sure we're allowed to skate this place, Suze? Yeah. The log folk are remembered here. Those trees laid down their lives and were reincarnated as the finest of boards. And then when those boards come to the end of their lives, you'll find them here as ghost boards. Huge respect. Let's smash this place to bits and truly show them how much their sacrifice means to us all. Uh, advanced trick through a ghost. Collect six ghost boards. Find and catch the zombie. Right, let's do it. Words. Ah, no. Gonna get these ghost boards. they're giving you like full like they've made these worlds so cool and they're like 2.5d so you can like go in and out of like the different planes either in the background or in the foreground i think we did we do it all that felt totally spiritual right shift absolutely the log folk who have passed to the radical other side live on in every move we make the spirit of skate never dies. That's beautiful. Dang. Am I crying again? Let it out, dude. Crying is like a peaceful rainstorm on the window to your soul. True words, Chiffon. True words. Did I not get six ghost boards? I did unlock the spooky board. Let's go check that out. Uh, all right, so if you go to customization, let's get spiritual, spiritual. Uh, again, there's so much customization. It's almost like Animal Crossing with how much customization there is. 
Um, I have tattoos, you can't see them. Uh, look at this. Look at this ghost board. It's a spooky. It's such a spooky board. But like every level you get to unlock a whole bunch of stuff. And this is only showing like the stuff that I can unlock from the areas that I've been in so far. Complete all challenges in Chuck's Lake House Skate Park. If that's next, look at that thing. That is a, it's a woodchuck. Love it. These are all just like super, super cool boards. Board. <laughs> My daughter likes to, likes to walk around the house going, ooh, I'm a spooky ghost. Makes me think of the, uh, let's see, what's this? The Hidden Hills? Epic Falls. Let's do it. This might be the last one of the, of this area. After this, after the stream was over yesterday, I just like left my headphones on and listened to like all of this, um, all the music in here. Did you enjoy exploring Cloverbrook? I want more. Epic Falls is the perfect location for our final hail thick Mary. For our final hail thick Mary. It's a shame you didn't meet Flora, eh? If you were true to yourself along the way, you will. Flora has been watching each and every one of us. It's not creepy at all. All right, so meet BB Hopper, of course. Land a perfect advanced trick for the crowd of woodland creatures. Air over nine bees. On it. Let's do this. Look at that wall ride. Look at that wall ride. That was not, uh, that was not ideal. Oh, back at the start? Fantastic. Still alive. So each of those things that I like kind of pass that goes like ka ching is uh, a checkpoint. So it allows you to like get back into the level without like really feeling like you've missed a lot. Or that you have to like rescape the whole thing. Nope, that's not gonna work. Much air, much success. I didn't really mean to go this way, but here we are at this point. Oh, look at that wall ride. That was rude. We're all going like, uh, uh, Flora, the gorilla gardener. That was totally botanical. You were photosynthesizing out there. Could totally get what Chiffon sees in you. I'm Flora, the spawner of fauna, the wall ride guide, old leaf out of the woods. Right now your path branches two ways, you twig. Come on, y'all. In one direction, you come to ride the infinite woods of Narvana Leaf, uh, Leaf Vana with me. In the other, you seek out the mirage and lose yourself to find your style in the deserts of Burnt Rock. Burnt Rock. Don't forget to check out my masteries. Fertilize your skills. Grow your roots. Peas. Jesus Christ. Peas and love on on your quest, kid. Uh, uh, pe peas, peas and love. I uh, didn't unlock anything on that one, but that's okay. Willow Peak. Oh, like Willow Peak? Like like a Widow's Peak? Interesting. All right, let's continue. Uh, all right, so the other thing is is when you meet a new one of the skate gods uh, in Narvana, it opens up an area. You've finished Cloverbrook. So 
now it allows you uh, to, when you go to Nirvana, look, an alien world, love it. Uh, when you go to Nirvana, if you do the Nirvana portal, you can now do levels in uh, the first two areas, like of all the areas that you've completed so far. So I could do it in the South Cloverbrook or Sunshine Valley. Uh, also in the main menu, oop, you can come back out here and you have Mastery. Uh, and now it's challenges from the different gods. And when you uh, do it, you will unlock uh, different uh, different stuff. So I'm assuming it's most of like their clothing uh, that you get to unlock. Uh, but we are a long way from uh, what, is, what I assume is uh, Flora's head because we need 25 million points to unlock it. Uh, and we're, we're not there yet. We're, uh, we're not there yet. Uh, but we'll go... Uh, and so here's the trictionary. Here are uh, all the ways that you can do tricks. And it's basically like this is just the way that you do you take the left stick and an ollie you just uh, hold down and then let go kick flip uh, left heel flip right no fly up and then you do like quarter turns uh, advanced tricks are like half turns or three quarter turns uh, special tricks which are wild are like half turns one direction half turn the other way uh, and then grinds it just kind of depends on which way you do uh, which way you hold stuff and then uh, special grinds. If you like press the stick a certain way, and then uh, it's very it's very uh, familiar to uh, a lot of different uh, games, but also to obviously Ali Ali and Ali Ali World. The thing that they've really made more accessible is the fact that like if you don't like Ali Ali and Ali Ali World really required you to like hit the button when you landed so that it wouldn't like stop your progress. And here it's not as important, or at least it doesn't seem as important. Uh, all right, let's go to Burnt Rock. Well, uh, let's see, it is 1.52 my time. We'll probably get another 20, 25 minutes. Just do a little short, uh, little short stream. Home sweet home. This is a tutorial on grabs. Uh, when you're in the air, if you hold the right stick one direction or another, you'll do a grab. Home sweet home. You grew up around here, Siobhan? Yes, these deserts are the perfect place to learn grabs and tweaks. Teach me. Hold the stick right in any direction to grab. Hold it for long enough and you'll tweak the grab. Don't forget to let go free land or you'll slam. Grabs are a rad way to maximize your skating. Grab on big air so you look even more radical. We're gonna grab some amazing footage of alien UFOs here too, right, Zeus? Uh, say what now? <laughs> Heard a rumor about that. Uh, I think that's enough conspiracy theory to chatter for one day. Grab and tweak this route. Maybe you'll discover some Burt Rock secrets for yourself. You can tell us about the aliens later, Chef. Alright. Uh, cool. Oh, what a tweak. What a tweak. Characters in Gravity Gravity Falls. So look at those look at those cactuses in the background just vibing. Uh, so all about those cool uh, extraterrestrial beings. Patience, Michael. I want to visit my friend Dusty. We shall go there now. Does this friend have a contact with aliens? You can ask first. You can ask her for yourself. She's the leader of Bone Dogs, a local crew of Burnt Rock. A wise soul. Yes. That shirt. It's like a real uh it's like a real fancy bowling shirt. Thanks, show off my sweet tats. Let's go customize. Hey, Burt Rock's a little hot for this jacket, so we're gonna uh 
some items on this page will be hidden by an already equipped item. Yeah, 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 I'm aware. I know what's up. Uh, let's see. What? Oh, that shirt's... Yep, I know. I'm going to take this windbreaker off. It's a little warm out here at Burt Rock. Yeah. All right, let's, uh, let's update these tats. Is that, a, is that just a piece of wood on my face? Not really into the, uh, all right, we'll do that one. I'm not really into the, the face tats of my character. That's personal preference. The jacket had to go. It was a good jacket, but this bowling shirt is killer. If it only it was so easy to switch up. Bless the burning rock, Shifan is here. Greetings and cosmic, cosmic salutations to you, Dusty. We are helping to train this young skater on their path to Nirvana. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I have, I have been working really hard to get here. Ah, Nirvana. We've all been there. You have? Sure. We bone dogs hang out with the Mirage all the time. Feel free to skate here. Helta Skeleta is an earthship we built from items we found in the desert. Satellites, bones, flying saucer type things, mysterious artifacts. It does attract vultures, so boop them if they get in your way. I have some questions. Uh, all right, do four grabs before the first checkpoint, boop the vultures in the boneyard, tweak two grabs for the crowds in Cac Cactus Village. These levels are getting a little more difficult. Ah. I wonder if Bone Saw is here and ready. Bone Saw. Having a hard time remembering to use uh, uh, all right, got the got the vultures. I'm having a hard time remembering like if I tweak with one if I tweak with one stick to then tweak with the other stick or to like land with the other stick. So, is this a place where weird happenings happen? Sure, I've, I've seen happenings. Whoa, for real? And did you ever get to the top of secret classified alien area? Of course, just up the road near the supermarket. Flip a deck. So you can buy a can of soup and then see a UFO on your walk back? Hey, do you think the aliens do their shopping there too? I heard they communicate to each other through floating crystals. Is that true? Yes, this is where the happening happened. And you reckon all those weird alien crystal rocks are, are conscious? Shouldn't you catch up with your crew? I saw them heading off to Heavenly Hot Springs. Whoa, wait up, guys! Alright, so, oh, Dusty's glasses. Those are pretty cool. And Dusty's hat? Oh, God, I'm gonna have to come back and complete those challenges so that I can get both the hat and the glasses. The glasses are pretty rad. Flip a deck is going into my vocab. Oh, I love I love Mikey. I love Mike. Mike's uh, Mike's a great character. Uh, all right, where are we going? Oh, there's a Heavenly Hot Springs. Look at this. This looks like it's straight out of uh, Adventure Time. Tutorial smash grabs. Are we are we robbing something? Are we smashing and grabbing. Didn't see, that didn't seem very. Uh, 
Narvana of us. Smash grabbing is a special technique I developed when I used to live here. Heavenly Hot Springs is the perfect place to learn this skill. How do you smash grab? To smash grab, you ensure you're grabbing with R as you smash through a crystal. The crystals float from the hot springs where they're compact and hover around the area like magical clouds. Sure, sure does sound like a whole lot of fun to smash them to bits. Smashing actually re releases the energy of the crystal in the air. It's not destructive, but rather a beautiful transformation of matter. In other words, it doesn't matter. Smash them all, champ. I don't... I'm a little nervous. It's like a, it's just another thing for me to have to pay attention to. What happens if I don't smash? Do I just run into it? Okay, that's yeah, that's what happens. Oh, I have to restart the whole thing? Ooh. Blunk. Yeah. I do like that... Uh, I do like that the vocabulary of the game is when you, like, run into an animal that's, like, in the way. It says that you boop them. It makes me so happy. Thud. Thud. Agent Moore, thanks for the bits. Oh, I didn't... I didn't land it. I didn't, uh... I was still holding when I landed. Or if I just went slow and went under the crystals. For the rest of it. Now I'm just getting silly. Like, I, this is worrying me that I'm not, like, you smashing the crystals, though. I'm getting some good air off of these jumps, though. Smash grabs. That was. Don't. That was. Don't say it. Smashing! Yep, he went there. That skill might come in useful. Apparently, some secret skate routes are blocked by huge crystals. Also, I heard that local merchants use the crystals to advertise products subconsciously. This place is weird, man. Hobo logo uh, pants? Alright, cool. Cool. I like pants. Pants are cool. Uh, yeah. Uh, so Tuesday is Gloomhaven. Wednesday is played up. Uh, Gloomhaven. We're we're moving along in Gloomhaven. Uh, it's definitely not a short campaign, but we gotta we gotta finish for uh, Isaac has this baby. So we gotta make sure we're uh, we're staying on top of it. Uh, but we're loving it. It's a great game. If you haven't checked out uh, Gloomhaven Digital, go for it. It's good stuff. Can I just say I have no actual skateboarding ability? So this is the famous Area 41, huh? This is the famous Area 41! Uh, I'm gonna say who cares, let's skate. Let's just get on to the challenges. Uh, grind the rib cage for over the crash UFO. Smash five crystals. Do a trick over the dancing aliens. Nah. Oh, I didn't even see those coming. What is that? What is that? Did I just miss a whole area? Oh god. Things were falling. Gotta stay on your toes here. It's just another thing to, like, pay attention to. Like 
That was. I kind of want to do that again. That was rough. Hey, that wasn't so difficult to find. Burt Rockians have built their own version of Nirvana as a tribute to the Mirage. How does the digital game stack up against the board game? Oh, Gloomhaven? Uh, I mean, it's pretty much about the same. They, um, they've made some tweaks, just kind of like some UI tweaks and some uh, quality of life tweaks in the digital version, but it doesn't like affect the game any. Uh, they've also implemented some rules that are going to be uh, used in Frosthaven uh, because they just kind of make more sense. Um, but again, we so we play Gloomhaven with uh, Isaac Childress, the designer of Gloomhaven, uh, and he has never said anything negative about the, the digital version, uh, and I think he'd be pretty honest about uh, things that were wrong and things that um, that weren't like true to, to Gloomhaven. So, um, you know, it's I enjoy it. I've never played Gloomhaven before, but from what I understand from the people who have played, um, it's pretty... Uh, pretty true to form anti mind control cap and martian suit all right we're just gonna try and score 99,000 here and just go for it i want that martian suit i'm not gonna lie all right we're devoting we're devoting uh we're devoting the next little bit to trying to get that martian suit I need it. All right, everybody, stop talking. Who cares? Let's skate. All right, 99,000. We can do it. Getting this 99,000, y'all. I want that alien suit. Oh, I ran out of I ran out of steam. Oh, okay. myself on the on the thing. I mean both literally and figuratively. Alright. To a nose manual, to another nose manual. Oh, Alright. We're getting this alien suit. I'll be here all day if I have to. to the target tour. I don't know what that was going to be, but that was... Oh, wait, are we... That's the one thing that like I keep forgetting to do. Alright, 
So it's already moving this because we've already been through that section. So I can't try and like... I'll get it eventually. I'll be able to get the score I want to get in this section, but I want that top route. Kind of speed. I gotta remember that it jumps on the after the second part. Alright, over. It's not. Ugh, it's the right stick. It's the right stick, and I had it this time too. something I really wish I could skip through like the whole like all the dialogue if I did if I've already seen it before I need a 99 one more one more I'm not connected to leaderboards uh, all right, we're going. We got this. Devs, are you listening? Oh no, this is, it's not gonna work for me. What happens if you do that part? through this section. manual, another manual to grind up. There we go. Yeah, let's go. That was the most reluctant let go I've ever said in my life, by the way. I'm 
like so in the zone of like my own head right now. Jump. Oh, I want it so bad. It was a good try. It's just not gonna happen on this one. God, that Martian suit looks so cool. All right, one more. No, I can't do. I already hit A. I already hit A. Got other things to do. I think. I don't know. I wanted it. Let's go over to, uh, let's go to Nirvana real quick and do today's like Nirvana League and I can show you kind of what that's about and then I'll do, I'll do one or two runs on that and we'll call it a day. Again, thank you all for hanging out, uh, for a chill chat stream on a Friday. Sorry, I've gotten so, like, into this. Did I get promoted? Did I get promoted last time? Let's see what happens. Oh, I got sixth, so I moved up to bronze to bronze two. Look at me. Uh, the more I level up, the more uh, I unlock. All right, so let's go. Uh, I'll continue. Welcome to Leaf Vana. They can uh, compete with the nine other seedlings so you can blossom those elegant roots who just soils themselves. Keep it organic out there, you twig. I want to witness creativity, dedication, variegation, and germination. My leaf eye sees everything, but I'll pretend to only catch your best run on it. Don't wilt out there. Perfect. All right, join a league group. Three hours left in the day. play. Let's do this. Well, that's not a good way to start. I need a lot of speed in this run. speed in this run. Oh, I didn't let go of the trick. terrible could be wrong but i think you need a lot of speed this run yeah telling me uh, i'm in first currently uh this is just from people who join the group um all right we'll try one more uh, but i think i need a lot of speed i'm uh, being honest
Yeah, I already had more points in that run than I did before. Then I score just on that part of the run than I did the entire run last time, so we're getting somewhere. That was less? That was at less than my last run. Unbelievable. Restart that. All right, we'll do one more and then we're done. better 50,000 I can't ever do what just one more all right hard stop in the next one I promise nope that wasn't it that wasn't the one that wasn't the one we end on It's not the one we end on. Oh no, that is, that's not it either. Right, we got this. my hands with it. It was a good run. I liked it. It's a good game. I'm going to keep playing it. Um, as soon as I turn this off, I'm probably going to keep doing this run until I get something I'm happy with. But uh, let's take it back over to here. Let's, uh, let's see what's...